wonderful, wonderful evening, my people. I bring good tidings to all amazing family members nationwide. I really appreciate God for what he has done for us this year, sparing our life. I, I really magnify his name because it's not been easy, but with him, all things are possible. Uh, this year has been a wonderful year. But the only thing that makes me happy is that we have a God who owns our life, who never allows the wind of the pandemic to sweep us away. And um, he never allowed us to be, be destroyed by hunger and thirst. He has been faithful. He's been merciful. He has been so good and so nice to us. Despite the problems, the tragedies, the regions of the kingdom of darkness, God never allowed us to be victims of the grave. So I give him all the glory. On behalf of all amazing Care Foundation members nationwide, I say thank you, thank you, thank you. I want to appreciate you for believing in me and believing in the organization called Amazing Care Foundation. I honestly want to appreciate you once again for your kind of patience and composition and your faithfulness despite the delays of all that we are expecting. Amazing Care Foundation is an NGO with a vision and a mission. And I'm believing God by his grace. All our expectations shall not be cut off. I am making this broadcast nationwide to encourage us as an end of the year message to all amazing Care Foundation members nationwide. I am encouraging you to keep hope alive. We will get there. We will laugh. Our waiting, our perseverance, our endurance will never be in vain. We shall laugh at last. Yes, I know we've entered into several programs. We've entered into several projects. And we are full of expectations that it must come to be one day that they will all start rolling out one after the other. Beloved, I know we've been patient enough, but we continue to be patient until we achieve the success we are looking at. I want to encourage you to hold on to God. Look unto God and look unto God. Do your will, do your best. Do what you can do as a human being and allow God to do the rest. Beloved, I am very, very happy that we have come this far. We have not relented. We have not allowed our courage to fail us. You will recall that we entered into social exchange market grants in 2018. And we have been patiently following and waiting until other grants started emanating. As an organization, I told you I was not ready to go through that stress again. Yes, reasons, because I understand all the involvement. And being a, a professional um, social worker, I understand what assessing of grant is all about and what it takes. So, it is very, very glaring and very, very eminent that all that I told you of 
has all come to pass. How concerning all these grants? I've even told some people that bother to, to hear that everything is still boiling down to the stage where Sam is. Where are we all today? Are we not saying the same thing? It's not the same language? Beloved, let's be calm. Let's be focused. Let's believe. Let's wait patiently. We are going to reap all our stress. We are going to reap the reward of our stress. I believe you. I believe God that one day it shall come to pass. But all we need is patience. I know you have really invested little. You have invested much. You have invested minimally and maximally. Your time, your resources, and your mental and emotional uh, stress. But I want to tell you that we shall get there. We will get there. Only believe God and be focused. So on the aspect of sin, I want to assure you that they will deliver. They are working. Don't ask me how, where, when, but believe they are working. Very soon, we will hear from them as promised. Keep your mind at, at, at rest. Be busy with what you're doing. Before the inception of SEM, we were alive. And now that we have applied for it, let's just keep it aside and continue with other things we are doing. For salary for life, they are still on that same table for the endorsement by the government. No such money, I repeat, no such money can enter any country without the government of that country endorsing it. So we must allow protocols and processes and bureaucracies, bureaucracies to, to take place. So my dear, it will come to pass. Let your heart not be troubled. Believe in God. Believe in also your efforts. And I want to tell you, it will come to pass. So consigning the government cushioning loans, we all registered as, uh, most of us, some of us are registered as husband members. You are nothing as spoiled. Many, some of us received this loan. Maybe around 50, 60 people received it. It's unfortunate that some of them that even received did not make themselves known to us on the platform. That loan is still ongoing, but you know what is in this country. As of assembly has queried, we, we, we need to know this, we need to know that. But me and you, where we are, we don't know what they are doing. So they still say that they are still releasing the money till February. So still be on the watch out. It could still be your turn. So, and those of us that you know that we never relented in our effort to keep everybody busy. On our agriculture, we have entered into mushroom farming. We've encouraged people to join the Anchor Project, Cassava Anchor Project. Handful of us are in all these projects. Maize, we are there. And some of us are entering into the rice project. Please, if you have not entered into in any of this, make yourself available. Stop sitting idle waiting for grants. Keep yourself busy so that when the grant comes in, it will be an additional. If you don't know how to manage the little, when the when much comes in, I want to tell you you won't even know how to manage it. You can't just sit idle and you want heaven to throw, t throw things down for you. No. But I want to tell you, if you are busy, you will be able to continue to do that in a perfect way. If you know how to handle small, you will know how to handle big. If you don't know how to handle little, you cannot handle big. It just, that is just life. So understand it and key into it and continue in that manner 
be focused, my brothers and sisters, for the mushroom program, we've been able to go into um, a, a project with Ecobank. We've called on all our members to key into this, but no one wants to listen. Very few of us decided to listen, and we are going a, a, along with them. As I'm talking to you, we are almost rounding up the, the, the documentation and other things, and we are about to start. Investment into the medicinal uh, mushroom is just, is just one of the best things you can do. Why? Because it's an online farming. They call it virtual farming. I want you to leverage your needs on this. Do your registration now, 11,000, 16,000 Naira, with Afri Global Farms. Then when the uh, Eco Bank comes to help you to invest, that will go a long way. By the time they help you to invest the, uh, into, into this virtual farming, I think every, by, the, by the time you start receiving the alert every two, two weeks, you would have forgotten all this stress of waiting and waiting and waiting. So, beloved, I want you to understand that we cannot continue sitting down idle and waiting for grants. Grants will surely come to pass. Grants will come to be. And we want the grant to be an additional to an effort already ongoing. So, how does it work? The mushroom farming is one of the simplest and easiest farming anybody can do. Some of the state coordinators has gone into it. Some of the principal bank directors are there, our members are there also. You can, you can ask them how they are feeling about it. It is something you see your money as you are turning it out. Every other three months, you collect your money. If you want to continue, you continue. If you want to continue, you cash out and you go. So if you are interested, please join the Eco Bank, Amazing Care Eco Bank uh, uh, Mushroom Farming. We are on the telegrams. We are also on the WhatsApp group or you can private chat me, or private chat your state coordinators. They all know what is going on. So that is that. In no time, we are taking off. It's for you to just go, go on to the Google and Google uh, register your name with the Google form on the platforms of Amazing Care Foundation. And Echo Bank will give you account number. You go to the nearest Echo Bank and do all the formalities and open the account with your just 10,000 Naira. Beloved, it is as simple as that. When, as soon as we take off, the first batch is already ongoing, but you can still key in. Don't sit idle. Don't sit idle in Amazing Care Foundation. We don't encourage that. I want to tell you that by the time we continue like that, you also can be a grant maker to somebody. After all, it is somebody or a group of people that have gathered their own money to say, let us help people. So we need to do something. We are not called to be consumers. We are called to be also investors. So my dear sisters and brothers, the year is already going out and rolling away. We need to refocus, we need to re-strategize, we need to think outside our box. We need, to, we need to decide what to do with ourselves. Our updates on all activities of Amazing Care Foundation is on our Telegram, on our Telegram platform. So, my dear brothers and sisters, I want to tell you that 2021 is almost an, around the corner. In less than six days now, or about six days, we'll be gallantly entering or crossing over to 2021. I wouldn't want you to sit down and continue asking, when will this grant come, sir? 
be doing something, keep yourself busy. Key into one of the programs going on and keep yourself busy. And I want to tell you, we are going to have other programs. We couldn't do the anniversary of Amazing Care Foundation because of the COVID. And I want to tell you this year we are going to plan it out because I know a lot of things are coming up. A lot of the things we have, we have hoped for and we are expecting are coming to pass. So my wonderful people, you are a blessed generation, peculiar people. You are chosen among all people. You are chosen to be outstanding. And I want us to believe and help one another. Let's be ready to fly. If you cannot walk in 2021, you just have to do what? Crawl. If you cannot crawl, hmm, beloved, you must try to move at all costs. If you cannot even walk, start if you if you if you if you can walk and you know that walking you are above walk and fly all we know is that nobody should nobody should be static nobody should be emotionless everybody should be to keep moving in amazing care foundation there's no dormant in 2021 get ready we are preparing and all our efforts in 2020 is going to yield very wonderful results in 2021. I want you to key in all activities going on. If it is getting loan to get into agriculture, we have interestless loans here and there, and we make everything available on the platform. So we are getting prepared, and so I'm preparing everybody's mind. We cannot remain the same. God is going to give, God has given us a direction. All we need is to do what? Key into it and fly. God will not throw money down from heaven. But he has shown us, he's given us the, the initiative. He has given us the intellect, intel, uh, the, the intelligence or the sense to do what? To make wealth. So, even in the United Nations programs going on, I am surprised that we are talking about it, everybody's reluctant. All what we want is money, 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 money. But I want to tell you that things that we bring out money, you don't want to key into it. Why don't you key into it? Go and improve yourself. Knowledge is needed in this end time. Without knowledge, you cannot fly. Go and get knowledge. We have the uh, sustainable development uh, training going on. Outsiders are coming in and taking it, and our own people are sitting and looking. The, the diploma, the advanced diploma certificate and advanced certificate can take you to anywhere in the world. Sustainable development goals. If you get into the training, beloved, by the time your prefrontal cortex is opened, I don't think you will wait for grant again. You will begin to think outside grants. And that is why I want everybody to shine your eyes in 2021. Please, bell top. We are about taking off. We have stayed too long on that mountain. We need to turn to the other side and move on with our lives. Why we wait for the grants? We must be busy. If we are not, if we don't know how to keep ourselves busy, if we don't know how to manage nothing, we cannot manage anything. We cannot manage something when it's available. So let's not wait and become redundant and make ourselves accumulate a lot of problems on ourselves so that when the grant now comes in, Problems will take away the money. We we'll go back to square one. God forbid it in the life of every member of Amazing Care Foundation. In the name of Jesus. So, beloved, I encourage you. And I want to appreciate you once again. Thanking you for your steadfastness. Thank you because you know a lot of things are going to happen. Good ones this time around. Positive ones. Believe it. Sleep it. Wake it. Confess it. 
and begin to act it. There is a saying that says, if you want to be a millionaire, behave like a millionaire. So if you want to be a, a, a successful somebody, begin to think like a successful somebody. Begin to act it. Begin to live it. Begin to eat it. Begin to sleep it. Begin to walk it. And I want to tell you, failure will be far from you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless us all. And I pray for us this evening that the God who has brought us this far will gallantly take us into 2021 and will joyously enjoy and all the stress we pass through will be forgotten in the name of Jesus. For our, for our people that worked for Lagos State Health Insurance Scheme, I have admonished you and I'm still admonishing you. Have hope. That battle will soon be over. Encourage yourself. In fact, encourage yourself in the Lord. Look up to him. You have already persevered. The strength to wait and get over to that promised land, the Lord will give it to you in Jesus' name. So, beloved, this evening, I pray that the battle that the enemy is fighting in this end of the year, you will never be a victim. You will not be a victim of another man's death. Stray bullets will not locate you. You will not die another man's death. None of us will be, nobody will say, stand one minute for any of us again. I decree that death should be far from us. Adversity should be far from us. Accident and tragedy will not locate us. Those of us traveling, you will go in peace and come back in peace. And as many as are having one problem, are you sick? I declare healing upon you this evening in Jesus' name. Those that are hungry, the Lord that provided for Abraham at Mount Moriah will provide for you in the name of Jesus. I pray that our widows and our widowers, the Lord will fill that vacuum for you. We have neither gold nor silver, but we are asking that God, who has been sustaining you, will sustain you. Thank you very much. And I wish you all a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. God bless you all. In Jesus' name, amen.